I am amazed by, uh, uh, by some of the things that you've accomplished. You are uh, an incredible uh, sniper, and your, the longest target that, you, target that you hit in combat was, and I was thinking about this today, 2,100 yards away, which is 21 football fields away. Yes, sir. You're looking right behind me at the number two book on the New York Times bestsellers list right now. It is the autobiography of a North Texas man who is the deadliest sniper now in U.S. military history. Yeah, I'm dressed up for success, from my head down to my boots. I don't do it for the money, there's bills that I can pay. Well, you meet the warrior league. See you. Yep. See air and land. Well, I'm not going to throw the water, sir. No, well, say for the faint of heart, most men, they wash out, they quit. I'm not most men, sir. I don't quit. Oh, was she? Yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. Hold on, how you, you know all about us? What do you mean? What I mean is you're a bunch of arrogant, self-centered pricks who think you can lie and cheat and do whatever the fuck you want. I'd never date a seal. Wait, why would you say I'm self-centered? I'd lay down my life for my country. Why? Because it's the greatest country on earth, and I'd do everything I can to protect it. Like, I'm sorry what happened to your sister, but that's not me. It's nice to meet you. Not the Chris that you no. know? Chris was, you know, he was a humble guy. He definitely re represented the teams well. And like all special forces, Rangers, SEALs, we're professional soldiers, and we carry that. And more confirmed kills than any sniper in U.S. history. And how many countless lives did he save in the process of using his skill? Right, and that's what he talks about. What haunts him is the people he couldn't save. And I mean, that's a man of character. So that was a real part of the movie. You know, I, I read some of the quotes from the real Chris Kyle. He said, I hate the damn savages, talking about the Iraqis, and I've been fighting and I always will. I love killing bad guys. Even with the pain, I loved what I was doing. Maybe war isn't really fun, but I certainly was enjoying it. Um, I don't know. Eisenhower once said, I hate war as only a soldier who has lived it can. I, I just don't see this guy in the same league as Eisenhower. I'm sorry. And if you're a Christian, I know this is a Christian country, uh, I hate the damn savages. I don't give a fuck what happens. It doesn't seem like a Christian thing to say.